Web3 and Education Web3, also known as the decentralized web or the blockchain web, is a new paradigm of the internet that promises to revolutionize various industries, including education. The decentralized web is characterized by the use of blockchain technology, which enables the creation of decentralized applications dApps, that operate on a peer-to-peer -peer network. In this video, we will explore the potential impact of Web3 on education and how it can transform the way we learn. Decentralized Credentials One of the main challenges in education is verifying credentials. Traditional degrees and certificates are often prone to fraud and forgery, and it can be challenging to verify the authenticity of a credential. Web3 offers a solution to this problem by enabling the creation of decentralized credentials. Decentralized credentials are blockchain-based digital credentials that are cryptographically secured and can be verified without the need for a central authority. Decentralized credentials can be used to store information about a learner's educational achievements, such as grades, certificates, and degrees. The use of decentralized credentials can simplify the process of verifying credentials and reduce the risk of fraud and forgery. Decentralized credentials can also provide learners with more control over their educational achievements, as they can be stored on a blockchain-based platform that is owned and controlled by the learner. Decentralized Learning Another potential impact of Web3 on education is the creation of decentralized learning platforms. Decentralized learning platforms are blockchain-based platforms that enable learners to access educational resources and interact with each other without the need for a central authority. Decentralized learning platforms can be used to create peer-to-peer -peer learning communities, where learners can collaborate, share knowledge, and learn from each other. Decentralized learning platforms can also enable the creation of personalized learning experiences. By using blockchain technology to track and analyze learner data, decentralized learning platforms can provide learners with personalized learning experiences that are tailored to their individual needs and learning styles. Decentralized Content Creation Web3 can also transform the way educational content is created and distributed. Decentralized content creation platforms enable educators and learners to create and share educational content without the need for a central authority. Decentralized content creation platforms can be used to create open educational resources OERs, which are educational materials that are free to use, share, and modify. By using decentralized content creation platforms, educators and learners can create educational content that is accessible to anyone with an internet connection, regardless of their location or financial situation. Decentralized content creation platforms can also enable the creation of new business models for educational content, such as micropayments and crowdfunding. Decentralized assessment. Assessment is a crucial component of education, as it enables learners to demonstrate their knowledge and skills. Web3 can transform the way assessment is conducted by enabling the creation of decentralized assessment platforms. Decentralized assessment platforms can be used to create peer-to-peer -peer assessment communities, where learners can assess each other's work and provide feedback. Decentralized assessment platforms can also enable the creation of alternative assessment methods, such as badges and portfolios. By using blockchain technology to track and verify learner achievements, decentralized assessment platforms can provide learners with alternative methods of demonstrating their knowledge and skills. Challenges of Web3 in Education While Web3 offers many potential benefits for education, there are also several challenges that need to be addressed. One of the main challenges is the need for technical skills. Web3 technologies, such as blockchain, require a certain level of technical expertise, which can be a barrier for educators and learners who are not familiar with these technologies. Another challenge is the need for infrastructure. Web3 technologies require a decentralized infrastructure that is owned and controlled by the users. This requires a significant investment in infrastructure, which may be challenging for less developed regions or countries with limited resources. Furthermore, there is a need for regulatory frameworks that can support the development and implementation of Web3 technologies in education. The decentralized nature of Web3 can raise concerns about data privacy and security, which need to be addressed through appropriate regulations and guidelines. Conclusion Web3 has the potential to transform education by enabling decentralized credentials, decentralized learning platforms, decentralized content creation, and decentralized assessment. These technologies can provide learners with more control over their education, 
personalized learning experiences, and access to educational resources regardless of their location or financial situation. However, the adoption of Web3 technologies in education also presents several challenges, such as the need for technical skills, infrastructure, and regulatory frameworks. These challenges need to be addressed through collaborations between educators, policymakers, and technology experts. Overall, Web3 represents a promising future for education, and its potential benefits are worth exploring. By leveraging the power of blockchain technology, Web3 can help create a more equitable and accessible educational system, where learners have more control over their learning and can pursue their educational goals without limitations.